Across the Muslim world, condemnation of a Florida pastor's plan to burn the Quran on Saturday, the ninth anniversary of 9-11. From Pakistan. We strongly condemn this fanatic approach and oppose those who in the name of freedom and liberty are resorting to bigotry and undermining the work that has been done towards promoting interfaith harmony since 9-11. To neighboring Afghanistan. I get that I am that. Cleric Dr. Mohammed Ayaz Nayazi says if Muslims react to the burning of the Quran, the U.S. government will be responsible. The Reverend Terry Jones of Gainesville has vowed to go ahead with the bonfire Saturday, even though he's been denied the required permit. My, uh, uh, this Kabul resident says he condemns the bad actions of Americans. Muslims around the world will stand against them. In Lebanon, Shiite cleric Ali Fadlallah says the whole of Islam is confronting a dangerous turning point. He says we are witnessing hateful calls to burn the Holy Quran. He says Muslims must close ranks to confront those who are plotting against Islam. Secretary of State Hillary Clinton has denounced the plan burning. The top U.S. and NATO commander in Afghanistan has said it could lead to attacks on international troops. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.